2018. Let's freaking get it. Yo, man, even the camera is fixed. This is a sign, guys. Welcome back uh, to day 137 of the $10 to $1,000 challenge. Uh, today is, is our first stream in 2018 and I started already like two hours uh, earlier so yeah I couldn't wait anymore so I started grinding earlier uh, we have a couple of new uh, things and improvement improvements <laughs> that I need to tell you or get you familiar with before we start uh, the biggest is the new mic. I picked up uh, the Blue Yeti mic. So the sound is or sh should be better. Uh, but yeah, we might run, run into some technical problems because I, you know, haven't done any like test streams or something. So I don't know if the sound is cracking or whatever. Let me know if there's something wrong with the, with the sound. I will fix that. Uh, then also we have uh finally the custom emotes badges and stuff like that for for all of you guys who are subscribed to me so go ahead and and enjoy them and i hope you like them uh and other than that i don't think there's anything else that i wanted to tell you yeah I just wish you a happy new year let this year be successful uh to all of you and yeah you will definitely see me on on Twitch streets, you know, we taking over. Uh, yeah, so let's see what tournaments do I have right now. Uh, I'm six tabling at the moment. Uh, and the most interesting tourney is probably the Big 330 because we kind of nearing the money. Yeah, we 20 people away from money in the Big 330. So we will watch this. And what else do I need to do? Start a timer. Always freaking forget about the timer. We already live for five minutes, right? Uh, okay, so the timer is up. Uh, then I'm also gonna play play some music for you and let me know if the levels of the music and microphone uh, is okay. Uh, and if it's not, I will try to adjust uh, adjust it. Uh, the music seems to not be playing. I don't know why though. Um, okay, I'm gonna fix that. <laughs> Why the hell is he not playing? Okay, so let's see what's gonna happen. This guy called here six big blinds against Queen Jack. Okay, it's a Jack. Oh, I probably know. I probably freaking know. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> Hacker in the house. The music is up. The music is up, right? Bro. Hey, I'm a fixer, guys. Freaking fixer. Saint Ryan says, "Good luck, good luck today, bro. I followed you on YouTube since days four. Get this challenge done. Thank you so much, Saint Ryan. Uh, we are against Deuces and King Ten. Looks like we're gonna double up. Nice or triple up, right? Is that a trip? Oh my goodness, we tripled up. Yeah, I also have a new setup, so I'm not kind of used to like where everything is. So it will get, uh, or it will take me a while before." I'm in my zone once again, I guess. Uh, we also all in here with Ace Five against Queen Jack of the same suite, so hopefully we hold. And we don't, unfortunately. Ennis says uh, discovered you two days ago. Started watching the journey like a cocaine addict. <laughs> Thank you so much, Ennis, man. Thank you so much. Don't do cocaine, though. Okay, I'm not talking from my experience, but cocaine is bad, bro. Without bitches, make sure you get some bitches, bro. Nah, nah, bro. No, no cocaine. Only bitches. Yeah, I don't like it under the gun, but I'm going for it. Cave okay, against King Queen. And he hits a king, and we out to the big Twitter, unfortunately. Uh, GG. Novici says, people say you are a bad player because of the downswing. I disagree. You are alright. Right, bro? I am alright. I mean, I'm not saying I'm the best player, but I'm alright. I mean, we can turn $10 into 1k. I mean, yeah, people like sometimes they just... First of all, I don't really like uh, care what people say about my game. So that helps me a lot. And second of all, a lot of players like when they run bad, they start to work on their game. 
you know and when they run good they think they are good even though their games suck you know so it's really you have to you gotta have the skill to recognize r what is run good and what is real skill and what is run bad and what is playing bad because there is a difference that uh, a lot of players uh, are not able to see and recognize so yeah but you're right i'm all right you know i'm all right uh, i'm gonna switch to that 20 we have packing jacks uh, on the big blind and we would like to get our chips uh, in the middle before the flop uh, i'm also only with aces and big one ten let's see what's ha it's gonna happen uh, against ace 10 here, bro. That flop though. Um, okay, so we outer had 220. Uh, and we are against 10s in a big one 10. Nice, at least we double up here. Ace Jack suited. Okay, so 2.5k is gonna be the opening size. Why? Because I just hell came up with it. Okay, that's why. 2.5 big blinds. Okay, uh, sneaky check. We don't have the ace, bro. Um, no cards for free, though, so let's charge all the clubs. You can tell by my face expression that I don't like this freaking uh, river. What calls us? A club. <laughs> what got there? The flush jaw. God damn it. Oh, okay, actually has ace king, so we have a kicker problem. Uh... Yeah, he's probably falling to a bad right, but I mean, how can I bluff? But I mean, we might as well go broke, I mean, if the flop... <laughs> if he, like, shows aggression on the flop, we're going broke there, so... Kinda glad that... We are still sitting here. Okay. Flop is Jack, King 9, we have the Ace of Spades. I'm gonna see bet. Man, probably call, I mean, he's shoving all the, uh, all the drovey hands, probably not two pairs, some weak kings, I guess, okay, weak king, nice, well, let's go for 4.5, Okay, actually, or something, okay, works, what's going on here boys, uh, yeah, we calling, let's see some hearts, okay, no hearts, an ace, I'm okay with that as well, hearts would be easier to play, oh my goodness, and a star with a call though. I'm gonna play this very, very, very safe. I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> can I fold an ace though? I definitely can. Yeah, don't try this at home. Like, Nid! What a Nid! Oh my goodness! Please have ace 10. Can you have ace 10? Okay, nice. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, bro, that was a genius fold. <laughs> Genius, okay? I just knew, man. I was so confident in my decision. Bruh. <laughs> um, take a flip. Take a flip. Hold. Bro. A four. Please, one time. One flip. No? Okay. So, yeah, Felix, you basically half monkeys, half aliens, bro. Is the truth. We were just monkeys back in the day, and then the aliens came and changed our DNA. Yeah, 
Let's go for some Queen Jack of Sweet Rangood. It's a little bit wider shove, but I mean. Dead River though, nice. Was that a triple up? It wasn't right. Something like a triple up. Okay, we got lucky one time. Got a call against Ace 3. That flop though. That turn though. Okay, so the outer hyper. Uh, not gonna re answer. The blinds are too high. It's GG for us. Uh, yeah, we show in fives with 15 big blinds against one limp. We probably flip in if we are called. Are we okay with that? Yeah, we flip in. And he hits an ace, and we out to the big one ten. Unfortunately, GG, LFG. Okay, triple up or nothing. That's a great flop. Okay, ace, king or spade. We don't get it though. Okay, man, we have a, we had a ton of outs though. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. 10-4. He limped on the gun, then called my shaft and his shaft. That's weird. Okay, so we out to the big 220 GG. I'm gonna watch the ex action uh, in the 6 max. Joseph Wega says, Kalancho, bro, love your stream and wanted to ask, did you need to lose a lot of money to start winning in online poker? I mean, I don't. When I started, like I deposited a couple of times, but it wasn't like a lot of money. You know, I deposited like fifty dollars every time, and I went broke a couple of times. So yeah, I wouldn't say it was more than five hundred. I would say, yeah, not even five hundred. So yeah, when I started, I deposited and went broke a couple of times before I started winning. So yeah, but it wasn't wasn't a lot of money. I would say it took me a lot of time more than money. You know, it took me like, yeah, like one year. Like I was just messing around for one year, like depositing $50, then went up, then went broke, you know, before I learned, like learning bankroll management helped a lot. So yeah, since I got into the bankroll management stuff and I learned something about that, that helped a lot, I would say. Bro, can you shove so I can isolate? Okay, just calls, floppy 7, 9, ace. Let's do 9, 80. Bruh. <laughs> nice turn, man. What the hell was that? Yeah, I didn't put him on 8 6. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Guy 3x, this guy 3 bets with a weird sized 3 bet. And we're gonna press two buttons actually. Two buttons. I'm gonna press this one and this one. Okay, against kings. Need that ace. You don't get it though. Okay, that's sick. Uh, we out of the 336 max GG. Uh, but I flapped a set here, and this guy says, Nice stream, man, and then he falls. <laughs> And give him a stream friend tag at least. So yeah, three tournaments left, two hyper tubos and the hard one ten. Jira says, hey Colin, what are your plans when you get down to 100 and 200 going back to sitting goals or YOLO MTTs all the way? MTTs all the way. I made that decision um, long ago, so we stick into MTTs. Uh, if we drop below 200, we're gonna adjust the buying range, so we're gonna play uh everything or the maximum buying we're gonna play is 220 basically we're gonna apply 100 binds plus bankroll management and, and stick to it you know and if that happens i'll 
be excited as fuck by the way i mean bro the story would get better i mean i don't know if you realize guys <laughs> but the more i go down the more epic it's gonna be when we reach 1k so it's win-win for me no matter what happens even if i go broke i mean it's still a win for me so i'm really enjoying enjoying the process even though it, it we are experiencing uh, another uh, downswing right now but yeah still enjoying uh, the process yeah i mean i'm in love with that so it's a win-win for me no matter what happens uh i'm all in in the hyper tool with ace jack against ace king unfortunately a uh, jack okay is that a picture of felix <laughs> felix bro i hate you <laughs> okay so we out the hyper tool no i'm kidding felix you know i love you gonna be all in with nines in hard one ten and he says what do you think about cash games isn't it easier to reach your goal it is easier and that's why we not gonna do it <laughs> no cash games it's harder without cash games and it's rule number one of this challenge no cash games so no cash games bro let's go nines i think that's ten that's ugly we're still alive though we are short but alive lfg is not gonna be easy especially not against um <laughs> pocket nines and ace queen bro what the hell was i supposed to hit <laughs> a nine right not even a nine okay that's like jack was actually the best freaking card that could come you know giving us uh, an eight and a king uh, as our outs <laughs> yeah this was really unfortunate uh, we outed out one sandwich means that we only have the 220 hyper left so let's see what we can manage to achieve here King 10, 5 big blinds, let's go for it. Triple up, we are against ace, deuce and sixes, oh man, that flop though. Nice, okay, we triple up. Two eighteen left, 215 will be in money. 10 seconds in time, bang. Hand for hand. Yeah, hand for hand. We shove an ace three. Man. An ace. Okay, do we min cash? That's the question. Let's wait and see. Yeah, we min cashed. Okay, guys, so we done uh, for tonight. Um, we started tonight with 391 and we end up with 367. So we down 20 something dollars, which is not that bad. But yeah, we dropped uh, down in stakes. Uh, so the swings are not going to be uh, that huge. Okay, guys, thank you so much for uh, hanging out with me tonight. And I'll be back on Wednesday. Peace.